<laughs> Heck yeah. Starfield. Hell yeah. Yeah, where did you find that ridiculous outfit? <laughs> uh, saw that and I was like, what? What in God's name? I think it's so funny looking though. Busy at the moment. Yeah, you look real busy. Have a good one. Okay. Oh, here we go. The delayed Working speech. Working at the office of Interstellar Affairs is honestly my dream job. Work around here? Yeah, I work at MAST in the office of Interstellar Affairs. I'm a sort of liaison between the UC and the Free Star Collective. I help solve communication problems, show visiting diplomats the city, things like that. Probably doesn't sound all that exciting to you, but I love it. I've been interested in a diplomatic career since I was a kid. Are you from here? No, I'm from Neon. I moved here a couple months ago for a job at the Office of Interstellar Affairs. Your makeup shit. I put on lashes. <laughs> Looking like a whole e girl. Oh dear God. Oh, not the e girl. Uh, thanks, homie. Uh, I haven't uh, just worn contacts in a while. So I was like, hey, why not, right? Uh, can I get some talks? Okay. A large mocha frappuccino. Large mocha frappuccino. That's definitely what I was for you. That's it. Your total is six thirty-seven. Great, thank you. Why is he going backwards? Good, how are you? Can you go backwards around the whole building? Why? Why not? <laughs> <laughs> I was so confused that the driver's side was on yeah. here. What in the world? Uh, can I get a large mocha for- <laughs> Oh, man. What a weird, random thing to do. I suppose if, like, nobody's in line, then whatever. Nobody's there. Okay, let's see if... God, this is bright. Um... Hmm. 
There we go. I think this is it. It's the one for the suit. Okay, cool. It's a foreign car, so the seat is on the right side of the car. Like, what a... <laughs> awkward thing though like I mean at least they accepted it why why not whatever why is that guy level 12 why? wait did we watch this one story. did we watch this one I think we watched this one did I click oh yeah I went way back okay must win this one wait, wait, wait what did this say Starfield skill magazine increase your carry capacity travel to the eye in the alpha centauri system watch it i want to see it okay hang on i'll watch it again after this once you dock go forward to the right until you find the weight room Find a small red table on the left of the room. Enjoy carrying more weapons and materials. Ah, oh, okay. Heck yeah. Solid. That would be nice. No, that's not it. Here you go, skinny. Why is that guy level 12? Like, this is main story mission. And I'm level 5. And that man's is level 12. <laughs> Just a Bethesda moment. <laughs> that was great. Complete set of space gear that's super OP and each piece increases your carry capacity. That sounds like my kind of outfit. You are a sight for sore eyes. Before spacers broke into the uh, outpost, I was Pasco. Really, Torres ain't bad as far as COs go. <gasps> activity in the area. Pasco. Uh, <laughs> You will be easily defeated, and the knocks are out. Before spacers broke into the outpost, I was relaying. Torres ain't bad as far as COs. The way he swung. The activity in the area has ceased. Oh, that's good. Homie ain't taking no crap. Breaking news. That 70s show oh, actor no. Danny Masterson has been sentenced to 30 years to life in prison for two counts of rape. Los Angeles Superior Court Judge. Why is he smiling, dude? To life in prison for two. That is like so disappointing. I love his character, and then like, I remember looking into him and it was all going down. I was like, why does he have to be a garbage person? Two counts of rape. Los Angeles Superior Court Judge Charlene F. Olmedo handed down the sentence to the 47-year-old Masterson after hearing statements from the women about the trauma they experienced and the suffering caused by yeah. the disturbing memories in the years since. The actor, who has been in custody since May, sat in court wearing a suit. Masterson watched the women without visible reaction as they spoke. Masterson waived his right to speak before he was sentenced and had no visible reaction after the judge's decision, nor did the many family members sitting beside him. His wife, actor Bijou Phillips, was tearful earlier in the hearing. The sentence was the maximum allowed by law. Masterson was famous for his role of Hyde on that 70s show and his appearance in the ranch alongside Ashton Kutcher. Masterson was known to be affiliated with the Church of Scientology, and the women that were victims have blamed the church for turning a blind eye. They testified that when huh. they reported him to Scientology officials but were warned against going to law enforcement to report a member of such high standing. I hate that it's like the fish reporting, because like, it's comical, but then the situation itself is just terrible. Um, screw that lady up. Yeah, that Vasco showed no mercy. I know his lawyers did not tell him not to smile. You would think he would not be smiling. 
So yeah, that very well could be. He'll be in his 70s when he's out. Dude should have uh, thought his past choices over a little better. Like, what a douchebag. Stay with me, stay with me. Flying to school on the bike bus? What? What in the world? Oh my gosh. There's so many of them. One kid goes down, it's gonna be a pile up. Oh yeah, put your hands on the bike, dude. The music. This kid feels so cool. Look at him. Oh, they just feel so cool. Look at me, no hands. <laughs> uh, look at these kids running. We'll keep up with them. I'm like, they're like waiting for him. Which just doesn't think it was as cool, right? We would have never done something like this. This would have been a little risky, though. I would have been, like, a little nervous being the person coordinating this. I mean, at least they all have helmets. Go, go, go! Get a few multiple bike crash. That's what I mean. I'm waiting for like, like if one of these little turds goes down, all the bikes are going down. They're all crashing. Maybe not all of them, but a lot of them like <laughs> would not be good. One little pebble. That's all it takes. That would have been fun though. The doctor in the back trying not to die. The time I swallowed a dog toy. What? I have to video you. I haven't done it. Can you say hi? Hi. Say hi, Maya. You're going to make some kind of noise? I already taped you on my phone. But I didn't tape it. Huh? No. Okay, so, so say hi to boy count. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'd be laughing the whole time. I would not be holding back. Poor kid. <laughs> the following is <laughs> Schedule four, one fall. I would be I'd be laughing though. Like Oh my gosh. <laughs> he stormed off. Oh man, he freaking stormed off. Okay, I thought he was taped. Why are they booing me? Why is he not a pimp? Why are they booing me? I hope this guy brought a lunch because it's gonna be a long, long. What do you mean by that? What do you mean I hope this guy brought a lunch? What do you mean by that? Because it's gonna be a long, long night. <laughs> Called out. What you mean? <laughs> oh no. Four to six. What? No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Super <laughs> team. <laughs> that last one is a mood. Uh Yep, pretty much. The stages, the different stages, straight facts. That last one especially. Oh, and I'm going to show you how to get it. 
<laughs> so ugly, but it's so great. Quest line. You can do this as soon as you get the frontier ship from the tutorial. First, you want to locate the zombies music in the background. The system. In this system, you want to find Titan, which is the moon of Saturn. Land at the settlement called New Homestead. Once landed, follow where I go. Head straight into the New Homestead building. Continue going straight, entering the doors downstairs. You can sometimes locate Dr. Heliana around this location here, but if you can't find her, she's probably downstairs in the clinic. Talk to her about how terrible tourists are and offer to scare some of them with her costume. She will give you the monster costume. Now follow the quest line and scare the tourists. After scaring the first group of tourists, uh, head back to the dock, letting her know that the job is done. She will make you wait a while to get the second group of tourists. So find a chair and wait around for 24 hours. Go back to the dock and let her know you're ready to scare the second group. After scaring oh my the gosh. again, go back to the dock and let her know the job is done. She will make you wait one more time, so hop back on that chair and wait another 24 hours. Talk to the dock again, and you'll have to scare the third and final group of tourists. Head back to the dock the last time, and she will give you the monster costume, along with some credits as an added bonus. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this, this is... I want to see where it is. Starfield, and I'm going to show you how to get it. You won't need an upgraded ship to travel to this quest line. You can do this as soon as you get the frontier ship from the tutorial. First, you want to locate the soul system. In soul system? system? You want to find Titan, which is the moon. Soul system, Titan. Okay. You find out you can be a pirate. You can be a bounty hunter. You can be a diplomat. You can be, uh, what's that there? A pirate. I don't know. Oh, I do don't, the main but, quest I don't, first. I, we don't but, need but to listen. Come. I don't. I don't. We don't but need to have plenty of time to do that. I, no, I just found out we can, can we can be pirates just because if we wanted to be. We do Isn't not need cool? to be pirate. Isn't come that on. Cool? No. When don't, I put the hat on. Don't. When I put the hat on. Oh, for just <laughs> one time, <laughs> I would take the Northwest Passage oh my God. to find the hand of Frank. Uh, a monster costume. For the Beaufort. See, tracing she just keeps one going. Warm line through a land so wide and savage, Get and it. make a northwest passage to the sea. Westward from the Davis Strait is Cat dude's got some pipes though. To lie. Reaching out to the Orient for which so many died. Seeking gold and glory, leaving weathered broken bones. And a long for the dedication. lonely cairn of stones. Should have brought him more water. Ah, for just one time. I would take the Northwest Passage to find the hand of Franklin reaching for the Beaufort Sea, tracing one warm line it just through gets a singing. land so wide and savage, and make a Northwest Passage to the sea. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Right, can yeah, we, can we do the thing that we, we, we bought the game to do? <laughs> can we do the thing that we bought the game to do? Which... Uh, can we do the thing we bought the game to do? Oh, man. That's awesome. <laughs> Valve released a 55-page patch notes document for Dota 2 entirely written in emojis. And of course oh my it took gosh. me mere hours to translate. Some found it hilarious and turned it into a fun community game whilst others hated it. But I want to hear from the Valve employee who sat down and wrote that all out. That is... That's freaking extra. Holy smokes. They should want to kill the pirates. Screw the pirates. Oh man. Wait, this is the one. This is one of the Don't okay, I already forgot the area. You can find in Starfield and show you how to get it. Get it. You won't need an upgraded an upgraded to travel bus line. You can do this as you get the frontier ship from the tutorial. Blah blah blah. Locate the soul system. In soul the system Titan. Got it. Um, about to, I think. I don't think I quite did last night. I think I was about to. I don't remember. 
Titan and Soul. Okay. Thanks. Maybe I'll see you around. Titan and Soul. Oh, there it is. Speak to the commander. Tell about joining the vanguard. Um, is that what you even asked? Oh no, you're asking. Okay, never mind. Um, I need to see. I think I talked to the tree dude again already. Pretty positive. Yeah, we're good. Oh, well, maybe not. There he is. How's the trees coming along? Huh. Oh, okay, okay, I got you. I hadn't expected to run into you again. Looks like you're still hard at work. Indeed I am. The success of my previous venture, with which you so kindly assisted, has been brought to the attention of Mast. There is growing concern. Oh my. A bit of an unintentional pun, isn't that? Well, concern that things are going to get worse. The data we gathered points to a definitive trend. The vibrations coming from this tree are increasing in strength and frequency. Because we've never seen this before, not on this scale, we have absolutely no idea what the upper limit is. We don't know when or even if this will stop. Great. It's imperceptible by normal human standards now, but given time, while I hesitate to speculate on the possibilities, well, none of them are good. If these vibrations continue to increase in frequency, like you're saying, could possibly be harmful to humans. Yes, and not just humans. All organic life will be affected. Low frequency vibrations are not uncommon in this species. The vibrations help disperse nutrients throughout the tree. However, normally the vibrations are imperceptible. If the vibrations continue to increase in frequency and strength, prolonged exposure could lead to harmful and potentially deadly side effects. It's imperative we find a way to correct this. There is data regarding other, younger members of the species. Unfortunately, there are some, shall we say, personal issues with acquiring it. <clears throat> per per personnel issues, if you understand me. My game is big struggling. Uh, must be my stream. My game, for me, is running just fine, but I bet it's Streamlabs. <clears throat> Which wouldn't surprise me. Uh, let me check it out once I quit talking to this dude. What? No, that is ridiculous. I am a professional. One of the other researchers in MAST, Emilio Hadek, has research I believe could be vital to my work here. He and I don't see eye to eye, and so far he's refused to turn it over to me. I'm hoping that if someone else were to ask, he might be more inclined to relinquish it. What do you say? I want Emilio turn over the data to you. He's held a grudge against me for years. It's petty, really. I'm sure he thinks that doing this now will hold back my career. He wouldn't listen when I tried to explain this isn't about me. There are bigger concerns. Oh, thank you. Last I knew, he was on a field assignment somewhere near the outskirts of the city. Uh, perhaps it's best if you don't mention my name in the process. I won't mention your name, buddy. What is in my hair? So we gotta talk to Emilio. Okay. Um, let's see. Might honestly just have to restart Streamlabs, I'm guessing, which is what it is. I might just have to restart Stream quick. Uh, let's see. Yeah. 
Stream does look rough, huh? I am going to... Uh... Um... Yeah, but no. But... I'm gonna restart it, because I think it's just Streamlabs. Hopefully resetting it will be okay. It's ran fine so far. I think it's just this program. I don't know. But, uh... Hold on. I'm gonna stop stream for a minute and then restart. So I will be back. Hold on. 